Hi! In this video, I will show you how to make Windows Vista not work anymore. In my previous video, I showed you how to do the same thing to Windows XP. Unfortunately, those instructions don't apply to Windows Vista, and since more people are moving to Windows Vista, I decided it'd be a good time to post this video. The first step is to head down to the star orb in the lower left hand corner. Click it. You'll be greeted with a search bar here where you can type in the program that we need to run. Type in CMD and you'll get a result by the same name. Right click that and run it as administrator. So click run as administrator. You'll then get a UAC box which is uh, just you know making sure that you really want to run this with administrator privileges and you do so we'll continue so now you're greeted with good old command prompt here and this is real easy all you have to do is type bcd edit dot exe space forward slash delete space and then this bracket thing, you're going to have to push shift to get this. That bracket. Current. And then close the bracket of the same kind. Again, you'll need shift. And now press enter. It should say the operation completed successfully. And now when we reboot, um, this should be completely useless. If everything goes right. We'll restart it now. Very nice, very nice. As you see here, Windows has failed to start um, because of a missing file. Uh, this computer is now completely useless until you uh, put the Vista CD in and repair it. But you know, you don't have to do that, and if you want a computer that will do this to access this screen here, you just follow the instructions that I laid out in this video, and you should be all set. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Check in next time. We'll, we'll be making other things not work. Uh, this is Farty McSimmons signing off.